Hi guys, so in this quick video I'm going to show you how to install the Elgato Stream Deck on Windows 8.1 and I'm also going to show you how to remove the OS Windows 10 check-in within the MSI file. So by default when you try to launch Stream Deck on any operating system other than Windows 10 you're going to receive an error message saying that this isn't Windows 10, so the software cannot install. Just to point out, whilst we can remove the OS check-in, and it will install on Windows 7, it will not work. I'm currently using Windows 7 to show you how to remove the, um, the Windows 10 check-in, because I've got the program called Orca already installed on this machine. Orca is part of the Windows SDK, so if you download Windows SDK for your version of Windows, this program will be present and allow you to edit MSI files and make configuration changes. So what we just do is launch Orca, drag and drop the Stream Deck um, MSI file into it, find the install UI sequence on the left hand side, highlight the not win 10 error, right click, cut the rows, click save, close the program, and then rerun the MSI file. At which point the Windows 10 check-in is no longer there, so this will now successfully install on Windows 7 and Windows 8, 8.1, etc. But on Windows 7, although it will install, it will not run because there's other bits and pieces that are missing. I'm not going to go into the technical details, but they're missing. They're not part of the OS as a as a whole, so it's not going to work. But I can show you it working on Windows 8.1. We've not fully tested all of the features within Stream Deck. But such um, options such as all of the Windows integration for launching programs, opening website, hotkeys, macros, all that sort of stuff, that works. Um, we've found no issues at all with that. Your mileage may vary, um, but for what I have personally bought the Stream Deck to use it for, it does work on Windows 8.1, no problems at all. I'll jump over to Windows 8.1 machine and I'll show you an operation. So here's the example of Stream Deck fully installed and fully working on Windows 8. Um, I'm not going to go through all the software obviously, this is not about how you use Stream Deck or the internet or what it is or what it does. It's just to show you that obviously we've bypassed the Windows 10 check-in. The software has successfully installed on Windows 8 and is all operational. So as a quick example, I'll just launch um, Google Chrome. Obviously going to close that window. Um, can swap the menus across, different profiles. Um, let's open Audacity. Um, shortcut key to close the window, etc. etc. So we are operational, um, up and running on a Windows 8 machine uh, with Stream Deck. Okay, guys, thanks for watching. Cheers, bye.